right guys so today I wanted to kind of do a short uh, post investigation video if you guys don't know uh, if you haven't been following the page we did the uh, investigation at the Birdcage Theater the night before last so um, kind of out running a few errands and I had to run to uh, next town over and pick up some stuff so I'm kind of cruising the hearse around I figured good time why not have you guys ride along and uh, we'll do this uh, post investigation talk about it a little bit my thoughts on it and figure have you guys along for the ride so uh, yeah guys, so I finally got to do the Birdcage Theater uh, night before last. I've been wanting to do uh, the Birdcage for years. I've lived in Tombstone for five years now, and almost five years, and I've been wanting to do the Birdcage Theater. Not just their tour that they do, the tour is awesome, but I've always wanted to do an actual investigation there. And I finally got the opportunity to do one, so uh, went ahead and did that. It wasn't a very long investigation. We were only in there for about four hours. So we didn't get really get to do uh, everything that we wanted to, but we got to do quite a bit. And I gotta tell you guys, it was an awesome investigation. Uh, really enjoyed it, caught, caught a little bit of activity. Uh, I'm gonna be honest, was kind of expecting we were gonna catch some more activity, but, uh, but you know, we still caught some and it was an awesome investigation. So uh, for you guys that don't know, I actually did, this was the first, um, first official uh, collaborative investigation that I did with another investigator. So Jen from over at uh, Hunting Haunting TV, hope I'm pronouncing that right. Uh, if not, I'm gonna post the, uh, I'll post the, the description down here on the bottom of the screen. But uh, got to do, I got, uh, Jen uh, got a hold of me about a week ago and get, had never met her before, had never seen any of her stuff. And she uh, got in contact with me and asked if I wanted to do the bird cage, if I'd be interested in a, doing an investigation at the Birdcage uh, Theater with her. And absolutely, I jumped on the opportunity and we had a really good time. I had a chance to look at some of the stuff that she's done. And uh, and you know what, I gotta tell you, she, she makes, uh, and I know she's gonna see this video, Jen, I gotta say, I love your style of investigating. Um, she keeps it really fun. So it was really fun doing an investigation with Jen, uh, Jen, Jen on this investigation. And uh, we just had a really good time with it. So, uh, my thoughts on doing the birdcage is, guys, awesome place. Uh, really enjoyed doing it. We caught some activity, which is going to be uh, coming up in the video. I'm hoping to have the video maybe up in about a week, by this time next week. Um, hopefully the video I'll have time because i got to go review all the footage. Uh, me and Jen are going to be uh, um, passing footage off between each other, so you're going to see some clips from... Uh, from her, uh, from her footage in my in the video for Wild, my video as well, uh, as you'll see hers, which I urge you guys, when she gets her video out, go over there and check it out. Check out her channel and check out her videos as well. Uh, it's gonna be real fun to see the, the video that she puts out for the Birdcage as well. Uh, so, Birdcage Theater, uh, I gotta say, they, it's just an awesome place. And when we, when we for, even before we got in the place, we had a chance, we were walking around town and we kind of drove we drove the hearse around town and kind of kind of talked about some stuff before actually going into the birdcage and i gotta tell you guys the energy was just really high going in there uh, so it was just it made for an awesome investigation and we like i said we caught some activity while we were in there we were only in there for like i said for four hours um so we didn't get to do absolutely everything we wanted to do but uh we got to do quite a bit of stuff and we caught some activity and i gotta say um, really good time so uh, like I said this is kind of gonna be a short video I'm driving right now I'm actually on my way back to Tombstone and uh, I got some stuff I got to do when I get back so I'm kind of trying to get back to get that done uh, it's getting kind of late in the afternoon so uh, I want to get that stuff back but I really wanted to do this uh, this post investigation my thoughts on how I felt the investigation went and I uh, wanted kind of wanted to take you guys for a ride uh, right along on this one you're gonna be seeing the hearse a lot more because if you guys have been following uh, the page recently uh, you'll know that uh, I just recently sold the van so uh, we won't be seeing the van anymore in the videos you're gonna be seeing the hearse a lot so you're gonna be actually using the hearse a lot more for uh, doing a lot more in the videos and, and transporting to and from investigations uh, and just uh, running uh, normal everyday errands as well because uh, currently this is my uh, my daily driver so but anyway, let's get back to uh, back to the birdcage. Um, so another thing that was big about the birdcage is, if you guys have also been following the page as well, you know that uh, 
I have a new uh, a new investigator with me. My brother Aaron has recently joined Wild, me and Wild Night Paranormal. He moved all the way here from Laughlin, Nevada to become a part of this and a uh, part of Wild Night Paranormal and, and be my partner in this. So uh, it was a really special night. It was his very first investigation. Him being in on this was really good. It kind of actually, uh, you guys will probably be able to tell in the video because my videos, are more, my other investigations are very serious because you guys know I'm very professional about doing this. Uh, about very, I'm very professional about investigating, and uh, but having my having my brother around, me and him are, are best friends, and and he really brings out like the more the, the uh, more of my humor out. He, my energy is different around him, so that really works well for investigating, and I think it really helped uh, in the birdcage as well because it brought out a lot more, a little more humor. We were able, you know, I was a little more relaxed, so it was like, the energy, you know, the energy was good going in, and just, it really made for a really good investigation, and we caught some, uh, we caught some, some evidence as well. We, we caught some action in there, so, uh, everywhere from, we caught responses on the ovulus, we got REM pod responses, uh, we got some response, we caught some stuff on the SLS camera that we were using, and it's going to be really interesting when you guys see that come out in the, uh, I'm not going to drop any spoilers in this video, um, but when the investigation, official investigation video comes out uh, sometime next week, um, you're going to see there's, we caught some really interesting responses off the SLS and, and, the, uh, uh, and the Ovulus, which really, really just worked itself into the investigation. Of course, I said I wasn't going to drop any spoilers, and I just dropped one, but didn't release too much. So. Uh, yeah, guys, so I hope, uh, uh, I'm really looking for, I haven't reviewed any of the footage yet, or any of the photos. I literally just got everything transferred over to my computer last night, and I had a lot to do today, so uh, I haven't had a chance to review anything at all. So I don't have any anything to put out yet, so I'm actually going to start reviewing. I've got some stuff i got to do in the next couple days, so I'm going to start reviewing the footage probably at the end of the weekend, uh, maybe even a little sooner. But uh, we'll, we'll just kind of, I kind of just got to see how it goes. Because right now I've got a lot going on um, between work and another project I picked up uh, that I've got to get going on. Which if you guys have been following the page and, and following the channel, you guys already know what that project is. So uh, it's time to get started on that because i really got to get it going. And because uh, I just got to get things working. So we've got a lot of other investigations coming up. Got a couple explorations coming up as well. Uh, so be watching out for those. Uh, I'll be dropping... Uh, the info on those and, and the videos for those coming up so with all that being said guys i gotta say okay birdcage theater like i said i've been wanting to do it for almost five years i finally got to do it uh, i got to do it with jen from over at uh, hunting haunting tv my first collaborative investigation with another investigator and it went really well and i think us working together on this investigation was really good i think it made for a really good investigation so like I said, guys, I'm, I'm getting kind of close to getting back into Tombstone. Uh, I just kind of wanted to make a real quick uh, post-investigation video about the birdcage. Didn't want to drop too much about it. Just wanted to let you guys know. Just kind of get on here and, and talk about how I, how I felt uh, the investigation went and my feelings on it and how, what I have, uh, look, how I'm looking forward to the video coming out for you guys to see. And uh, so, anyway, I hope you guys uh, enjoy, enjoyed this video. I'm glad you guys stuck around and watch this video with me. I wanted to take you guys along for the ride and uh, be watching out for that birdcage uh, investigation video. I'll be, uh, it's going to be coming out. I'm hoping to get it next, uh, about this time next week. So uh, be watching out for that. Of course, I'll drop the info on the, uh, I'll drop all, all the information on the social media pages so you, you can be watching out for that video. Uh, so anyway, thanks for watching guys. Uh, glad you were along for this uh, little ride along with me for this birdcage uh, theater post investigation video. Uh, I'm going to be doing more of these as uh, time goes on. So with everything that's coming up, got more like I said, more investigations coming up. So I will be doing more of these post-investigation videos. So thanks for sticking around. Thanks for watching. Uh, thank you guys for all your continued support. Uh, I look forward to seeing you uh, on the next investigation. And I hope you guys have a great day.